It'll be a race from the gun, ladies and gentlemen. An exciting 12 and a half laps await us. And off they go. The big Jerry Motau taking the lead. Sitting behind him is El Rangelan. Of course, the guy who will be chasing down this Olympic qualifying time. I think it's about time that this crowd gets behind him now. Passing the 300 meters now. Almost approaching the 400 meters. Let's see what they go through in the first lap and see if they are on pace. It's a bit chilly out here, so that might thread it. But, but let's see, 50, 60 seconds. It is quick, ladies and gentlemen. They are doing something special here tonight. The Carbs are clops are also surprising. The runners here and the fans out here tonight. Great athletics, great vibe, great atmosphere. It's going down here, but the focus now should be on these men's five th this men's 5,000 meter race, ladies and gentlemen. Going straight out, Motau Pukka. Holland seems like it'll be a race between them, or is it just Motau that's taking him out to make this possible? Also in the field, it's interesting to see. It's World 1,500 meter bronze medalist Johan Kronier, junior champion in the cross country and 3,000 meters Ika Heng, all the way from CGA. But look now at the second lap, they 202. Oh my word, this is gonna be fast. This is gonna be something special. This is really gonna be something special. El Rechalan, but now being spoiled here by the Kapsa Kalopsa. It's getting drilled, it's going down. But look at this now. Approaching the 1,000 meters. Jerry Matau taking Holland through the 1,000 meters. 230, 231, 232. Oh my word, this is fast. This is gonna be fast. I just don't know if it's a bit too fast. I'm getting excited. But hey, this is fast. Some entertainment here from the Carbs of Colopsa as this men's 5,000 meter race is happening. But I would really love to be, to see all the attention now on the men's 5,000 meter as they will try and qualify for the Olympics. Jerry Motsau and El Rojaland, but look at the relaxed and great running technique from El Rojaland. Looking ever so composed while it's being paced by the training partner. <laughs> this will be interesting to see, really. I'm looking forward to the middle part of the race and of course the finish of the race. But they're going hard from the start, ladies and gentlemen. Let me tell you this, it's looking good so far. course while this men's 5,000 meter race is happening we also have the men's this kiss happening in the middle of the field over there but look at this now ladies and gentlemen it's exciting to see oh my word Jerry Mataro just stepped out before 
two kilometers. I think it's time now that the crowd gets behind our line to make this happen as he approaches 100 meters to the two kilometers, five minutes. He is approaching two Ks, ladies and gentlemen. 506, 507, 508, 509, 510, 511, 512 through the first two kilometers. Home Howard. So Afrika and said, die is blitzer, dames en heren. Hij is bij een fucks. En zo zei Ali onder the all right land and it's now that the crowd is getting behind him i'm sure he's getting goosebumps while he's running oh he is looking for three seven laps to go definitely he is so in this race at the moment oh my word i'm excited slows down the pace now he can still make it happen he can still make it happen ladies and gentlemen even if he slows down the pace drastically he can still and definitely will qualify for olympics i just hope he didn't burn out but for el rojalan i really hope that he qualifies for olympics here tonight and as the crowd gets behind him as he approaches the finish line but of course still with six laps to go el roy Holland is the man of the moment. He is leading with six laps to go with 550 meters. Oh my, he has been talking on radio interviews about the shape he's in. He has been winning races. He won the SA 10 kilometer championships not so long ago, beating the legendary Stephen McCorka in that very same race. Also winning the best game half marathon. Clearly, he showed great form because he kicked from the very start. He just kicked and kicked and it's the same thing that he's doing in this very race now. But with 200 meters to go, we will see what his 3,000 meter time is. But for now, 7 minutes, 20 seconds. This might as well just be a 3,000 meters and under, will definitely be a 3,000 meter under 8 minutes, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my word. And the crowd must help El Roy here now. Oh. 7.44, 7.45, 7.46, 7.47, 7.48. Approaching the 3,000 meter in the 5,000 meter race. 7.53 seconds. My word. Dames en heren, blitzig El Roy gelang. Five laps to go. The only thing that can keep him going now is the crowd, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my word. El Roy Galant. There's no competition for El Roy in this race, but he, his mind is set on qualifying for Rio. That is what is on his mind while he's running this race. Rio, Rio, Rio. Again, he's coming into the home straight now, ladies and gentlemen. He's fast. He's Jauregeland. He's looking amazing and he's still going so strong. Man alone. No competition whatsoever. The crowd is behind him. 8.57 with four laps to go. This is possible. My, oh my. <laughs> And as the cops and clubs and leaves the stadium, the attention will now be on the athlete, the main athlete almost lapping athletes with, oh man, I'm so excited. Almost lapping athlete with about four laps to go. And he hasn't even reached the four kilometers, but he's lapping athlete. It's, it's he's lapping athlete. It shows what Elroy is doing here tonight, he's special, ladies and gentlemen. But look now, the crowd 
bringing him down the home straight with three laps to go. Only 1,200 meters to go. 10 minutes, flat, 10.01, 10.02, 10.03, 10.04. He needs to run a three minute, 20 seconds. 1,200 meters to qualify for Olympics. Did he go on too hard? Let's not hope so, because he is looking good, ladies and gentlemen. He's really looking good. Oh. You will need to be quick now. 10, 30, 10, 40 with 10, 40 with one kilometer to go. I'm, I'm running out of words here, ladies and gentlemen, because it's so exciting to see this man going out alone. Yorre Khalan going out alone. Ladies and gentlemen, alone. Will he make this happen? He don't have to be fast. He don't have to be exciting. Yorre Khalan. Oh, my word. 10. 11 minutes 10 seconds he will need to run a sub 210 800 meters to qualify for the Rio Olympic Games come on ladies and gentlemen we need to support this guy now so that he can bring this home he went out alone he left he left people it's a beautiful thing it's, it's, oh man it's happening it's really happening it's exciting with 600 meters to go, 1144, 1145, 600 meters to go, we need to see something special here, we will see something special, just listen to this crowd ladies and gentlemen. It's beautiful. You will need to do something special to take it. You will need to run really fast. He needs a 62 second final lap to qualify for Olympics. Does he have the speed? Does he have the endurance? There's no doubt. Yol Rehalan might just go to Olympics, ladies and gentlemen. We need to support him now with 300 meters to go. Oh, but look at the acceleration now. Tired legs, tired arms, but a strong mind. El Rehalan, who has been going out from the gun with 200 meters to go. He can do it, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my, this will be a great feed by Elroy Rehalan, who's coming in now. The guys, I just hope the guys open the track for 13, 20, 13, 13, 13, 05, 13, 06. Will you do this, ladies and gentlemen? And the crowd is on their feet. Go, Rekhalan. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Oh! Go, Rekhalan. Qualifies for the Olympics 2016. Olympics. Wow, that must have been so well planned, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, my word. 13.20, just what he needed. He went out fast, he kept composure, and he finished strong. Well done, Elroy Halangian Moidon.